What's up, friends? Well, the hot rods are back here at the RTR lab, already torn apart. We got our P1 champion, woo woo! Chelsea's P2 stallion, yeah! Um, but I want to show you guys a little bit um, about what, how we handle uh, our oil uh, post and uh, pre-race. So basically, during pre-race, we get all new, fresh, delicious, Penzoil 1060. Um, this is Penzoil Platinum, so it's full synthetic. Uh, it's natural gas based versus crude oil based. Um, so just a lot better uh, for cleaning, keeping engines clean, things like that. Uh, handles high temperatures very, very well and um, protects wear very well, especially uh, under abuse. Um, so what we do after the race is we drain it. So this is some drained oil. You can see it's a bit dirtier. A lot of that, you can still, you can even smell it, is uh, VP race fuel that gets a little bit of blow by, uh, which is not, not a big concern. Um, but, um, and then what we have here is some of our previous um, oil reports, which what, this one I found pretty interesting, uh, that basically in this, um, He's basically seeing uh, some lead uh, from the fuel blow by, uh, not a big deal. Aluminum is a little lower, which is nice, and the iron held steady. So this is compared to previous, you know, letting us know that our oil is doing its job, it's lubricating nicely, and we're just having kind of a consistent um, wearing, which is normal. I mean, motors wear. I mean, it's what it is, you know. Um, so this is really nice. Like everything is just kind of flowing as it should through its lifeline. Um, and then one thing that he mentioned here is maybe the last few race events included harder use than before, or maybe internal parts are leaving more metal behind. What's funny about that is, yeah, we're doing double headers, uh, and we are getting further, you know, we've been having a great year. So running more and more in the rounds, getting a lot of practice. Um, so it's pretty interesting that they see that a little bit more based on those weekends. Um, the other thing that's really cool is they confirm that the viscosity is on target for 1060 oil. So um, that seems to be a consistent thing in, in all of our results that our Pennzoil um, Platinum Synthetic is um, holding all viscosity, which is what you want. You put it in, you want it to stay the same until you take it out because when viscosity breaks down, that's when you have drama. And we don't want no drama with our race engines. So, uh, so yeah, this is, um, you know, I just wanted to share that with you. It's pretty interesting info to me, so I hope it's as interesting to you. A little fun haver uh, tech tips. You know, why not share knowledge?